Hey everybody, it's Brittany Hiller, and now my audio works. Yay! <laughs> for those of you who tried to tune in earlier and the audio was not working, for some reason I was on mute and I didn't even realize the little bar that I have here on my eCam was telling me that basically I was not having any type of sound. However, here we are. So I wanted to discuss with you guys really quick our H2O challenge, which is occurring on Monday. So the the idea of this is I need more water in my life. I need more water in my life. And so I want you to have more water in your life too. Yeah. And so for those of you guys who have said yes to this challenge, woohoo, I'm so grateful. Like this um, post right now and just let me know like you're in. And the way that we are going to do this is pretty simple. So our goal is, that's right, that's right. <laughs> our goal is, is that we're going to have eight ounces of water every two hours. So if you want to do the math, I think I did it like 48 ounces of water for a day. Um, feel free to already put that in like a big container and drink it throughout your day so that you know that you have completed the task by finishing that water. Um, another great thing too is for those of you that might not know this, our um, they say that the best way to get the most amount of water that you need is to drink half of your body weight in ounces of water per day. That's how much water we should be getting into our body to help hydrate our own unique body. So you can do that math as well if you desire and follow that amount of water <laughs> for your challenge each day. Your choice. Another thing for my friends out there who find that water they can't drink it because it's not very tasteful for them, um, I recommend utilizing fruit or vegetable only to flavor your water. Don't use anything that's you know, fake. <laughs> so no crystal light, no sugar. We're trying to avoid sugar. We want to flush it out. That's what we're going to help ourselves do and rehydrate our body and our cells. <laughs> so yeah, this is really powerful stuff. Um, I recommend if you don't like lemon, utilize cucumbers. Just slice them up, place them in your water in the middle of the night. Let it, um, let it kind of sit with it. And then it has an amazing flavor. You can also utilize mint, rosemary, um, Time, if you desire just a fresh taste to your water, utilize those. That's great as well. Um, mint and cucumber, for me, delish. Love it. Love it. That's an amazing flavor together. Um, I utilize water and lemon typically just because I like the flavor of the lemon. So, yeah, those are, those are options as well just to kind of have. It makes your water bottle pretty too. I'm, I'm picturing my mind. I'm using a mason jar. <laughs> That's what I'm using in my head. And so it looks so pretty with all of the, um, you know, the cucumbers and lemons and, and mint within it. So yeah, it's totally up to you. And I'm really excited to do this challenge because we're all going to have just flourishing, healthy, vibrant skin and amazing energy because we're all going to be hydrated. Now here is a tip as well for all of my friends out there who love sugary drinks. For every sugary drink you drink, have another glass of eight ounces of water after that. That means as well, any alcohol, um, any sweet tea, we live in the South, any um, Cokes, Diet Cokes, Pepsis, any of that, any soda, anything you drink that isn't water, that is sugar filled, drink another glass of water. So yes, you will be grounded and you must drink another glass of water on top of that because we're going to help flush that out of our system. All right, so I hope this was beneficial. I'm super excited for you to join me in this amazing challenge next week. We're gonna do this for a whole week. And then after that, I'm going to do a one month of um, yoga challenge. So we have had some amazing people in our live virtual yoga classes that have literally done more yoga now virtually than they did before in the studio. And that's simply because you can legit come to class Turn off your video because I have your video turned off for you. You do not come into class without the video turned off. You have the choice to turn it on. So yeah, once you come in, you have that video turned off. And then not only that, you have the opportunity to literally like roll out of bed. Don't even brush your teeth. Do your yoga. Feel fantastic. And then be on your way for the rest of your day. And that is what this this whole experience, mind you, has been really difficult for me, but it has been fantastic to just see everybody show up and practice. So I totally recommend and ask and invite you to join us in yoga. 
So we're gonna chart, we're gonna begin our one month of everyday yoga in May challenge, May 1st. So just to give you that heads up now so you can prepare for it. Yay, Heather's gonna join us. I love it. Yeah, so um, definitely check it out. I can't wait to see you guys there and let's get our water going, right? Let's get our water challenge on first. We're gonna do the water first. That way we're gonna be so vibrant and then we're gonna get healthier. <laughs> All right, friends, I love you. I'll talk to you soon. Have a beautiful day.